Hello, my name is Keith Abacary. I live in from Woonsocket, Rhode Island. I'm 28 years old and I'm really fun at video games. <laughs> Before I talk about games, I wanted to tell you guys some stand-up comedy, if I could. Okay. All right, here, the first stand-up comedy goes like this. According to facts, most babies' first words are gah. So I think what nature is telling us is that even babies say gah. <laughs> you get it? I did a verbal illusion on you. <laughs> that is so funny. <laughs> ah. Okay. So, I don't know if you've talked to any of their guys, but I think some of the crew's getting a little tired of me talking about classics. I think I've gotten everybody in trouble once too many times. He's like, brain dead. He got arrested because he couldn't find the front door to the convention center, so he checked the roof. So some producer in Providence wants to meet with me to discuss airing talking classics inside TV. I mean, it was only a matter of time. Talking classics is pretty huge. I mean, I'm getting multiple views on every episode. And everybody's been talking. Oh, Keith, you're so successful. You're such a world-rewound celebrity. You're tall and in the dark handsome. All true. So I guess I'll go down and meet with this guy and see what it is he wants to talk about. Fact. The Virtual Boy was the greatest system that Nintendo has ever made in my opinion. The only problem was if you wanted to play for an extended period of time, you'd have to sit at a moronic table using that idiotic stand that it came with. And that would hurt your back after a while. So, I had my Virtual Boy modified by Ty K. Lori. And what he did was he put it in this very tall, sleek arcade cabinet so he could play for extended period of time without getting any body paint. And since it has graduated to a larger, more mature design, it can't really be known as a virtual boy anymore. So what I did was I went a step farther and I modified the cabinet myself, making it now a virtual man. You can still relocate the virtual boy and play it in any desired location you please. And if I'm going to customize my Virtual Boy gameplay, why the heck it is I'm not going to do it to my NES? So, introductioning my NES coffee table. Not only is it a coffee table, but it's also only a Nintendo controller. It's fully functional, all the buttons work, there's a cord that comes out of the bottom and plugs into your console. The only difference is, with a controller like that, a guy like me could get pretty sophisticated with Princess Peach. He's gonna get himself killed. And I don't want to be the one filming him when he does. I don't know if I can do this job anymore. It's like he won't just play a handheld like a normal person. I would rather film a bunch of fake nerds that aren't taking risks. For me, my dream job is something that's mindless and predictable. Something that's easy. Ah, oh, I am so sore. 
My body is aching from a real rough night in bed last night with my virtual man. <laughs> well, I don't like virtual men, you know what I mean? I meant like, I like virtual boys. <laughs> the video game. I, I like to play video games. I'm sore because I was playing video games in bed real late last night. Video games. Go away, I'm trying to get my food now, I feel weird. So I had my meeting with the big time television producer yesterday. So I figured I'd drive something nice. Hang on, I ran out of credits. What? I ran out of gas. Do you have any cold things ordered? Get it out of my way. I, I can't. Run. I ran out of gas. Baby, can you give me the push? No, I don't have front. Just, just get it out of the way so I can get by. I can't move it. I ran out of gas. My mom came over the other day when I was playing Streets of Rage and she was just rearing all over the place. She was like, oh my God, can you still play those things? How old are you now? You can't be doing stuff like that. And I just said, mom, seriously, you need to stop and just let me act my rage. <laughs> Get it? <laughs> it's funny because of words. That was just another little stand-up comedy for you. I've seen your video game movies, and they are really, really great. Oh, uh, that's cool. How do you do that? How do you play video games like that? Um, I, I don't know. I just, I just play them. <laughs> you really do. Listen, I know you're a busy man. I'm gonna cut straight to the chase. I am real tight with a producer at Providence Cable Access. That's television, Keith. Yeah, kind of. <laughs> Love it. Your show, Talking Classics? Yeah, I want to air it on Rhode Island Cable Access National TV. Okay, does that mean I'll get like free video games? You're a celebrity, practically. You get whatever you want, what do you want? You think I could get a box copy of Maximum Carnage on Mega Drive? I think you should start playing the games, Keith. Let's talk about women. How would you like to be with a different woman every single night? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm waiting for a nice, gentle woman to come along and give me an emotional boner. That's great. Listen, are you going to get a big kick out of this? I did this the other night. This is a website for your TV show. Wow, cool gifts. Deal. Yeah, oh, that's fantastic. I celebrate with some pretty it's over, Keith. It's over. Nothing's over. Nothing. You can't just switch it off. Okay. It's okay. Calm down. You could always do a new series. Like, you could, uh... It wasn't my fault! Okay... They asked me! I didn't ask them! And then at home, on the internet, those maggots were protesting! They spat at me! And called me troll and stuff like that! 
Why protest me? They weren't there. They didn't experience it. Look, man, I know it's hard, but it's in the past. For you, civilian life means nothing to me. But you do some of the best game coverage. I mean, don't just leave it like this. Start a new series or something. Nothing's over! Nothing! Oh, come on, darn it! That's Frank Thomas Big Hurt Baseball! Darn it! You sure they want some pudding? Come on, listen. If it's a germ thing, I have a spare fork. Be silly. Okay. Yeah. Come on, here we go. Wow, it tastes like pudding. Yeah, it's pudding. Oh, the whole thing? In the tub? The whole thing is pudding. Oh, wow. It's chocolate pudding. Oh.